We're starting. Restart. All right, everybody. Sorry for the interruption. Uh, we were testing our capability to broadcast mobily um, back to a stable internet connection. Uh, we have Kriv to my left, Roman, Sakara, Bimble, and Marin around the circle. Um, we were discussing last session where the party uh, left the Pirate Isles, interrogated captives, uh, turned one over to uh, authorities in a port city, and continued on to Bakersville where they had learned Taldor's uh, main base of operation was located near. <clears throat> they uh, scried on Taldor using Bimble and Sakara's magics. Um, they watched him poop, they watched him torture people, uh, and they watched him meet with uh, one of his commanders, uh, as well as tour the perimeter of his castle. The party has decided to land uh, a few miles uh, west of Bakersville and proceed on foot to determine what Taldor's uh, influence on the town is and the people's position and feelings towards Taldor. Um, and that is, uh, that is where we'll pick up with the party um, preparing to uh, leave the ship to make landfall. Does anyone feel necessary to disguise ourselves? Me? I want to be a tree. How are you going to walk around and talk to people as a tree? No, I like trees do. We still walk in trees. Not in a city. Well, this time it'll be in a city. Yeah, I don't know if that's a good idea. Well, if you think about it, a forest is kind of like a tree city. So it happens all the time. There was discussion of disguising one of us as Teldor. Yeah, we should do that too. First, we should find out what the town thinks of him. Then possibly That's use that to our out. advantage. What do you think Taldor would look like as a tree? Like a tree. Like one that's about to get chopped down. How's our feed, Marn? Delicious. Are we actually... We're fine. Just, okay. keep going. Just keep going. Okay. Okay. I got I'd be more than happy blackness. to go into town and ask the people's thoughts on Taldor. I have no need to disguise myself to inquire. Bimble, Sakara, do you feel confident you can gauge their alliance to Taldor without giving away our intentions? Yeah, I'm pretty good at that. That is pretty good at that. Insight? <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm pretty good at that. I got... Okay. I mean, you've seen me in action before. I got a nine on my insight. At the very least, you believe it, so there's that. Yeah. Okay. I mean, keeping in mind how I tried to do that last time. Yeah, yeah. I, what's, but, what's wrong with finding out their allegiance by disguising as him? Because if we walk into this small hamlet, and one of us is disguised as well, Taldor, and he is a hated enemy, maybe or wanted for murder, they throw rocks or, or has been illegally complete. enslaving people like we know he has, then we will be assaulted immediately. Or they will cower in fear from him. Either way, I believe we will have learned a great deal, and it's worth the risk. And it may draw him home. That's it, well? is, it may. Okay. I mean, not having to see. Are we ready for that? We we do have the ability to do both. I mean, we can do both. All right. Who wants to be Taldor? I think I think you no. go for good Taldor. I don't think so. I'm more than happy to, but Martin was not. <laughs> that would take a hell of a lot of magic. Hmm. Well, he kind of claps you on the shoulder. Yeah. No. Probably easier him than me. Look, I don't know how it works. If you, if you say it's going to work, then let's make it work. I mean, technically it doesn't have to be any of us. I can just make it look like he's there. You make him walk and talk? 
Well, within the limited space, as long as he doesn't have to go too far, like stay in the same room. That's uh, like, that wanna, seems pretty good. Um, our only. Uh, I would think we want to tra- want him traveling throughout the town, not just hanging out in a bar room or a shop. Well, with this plan, the only reaction we're going to get is visual and whether or not people draw swords to attack. There's no way that we're going to determine whether or not he is a ruler of some kind or has taken people's slave as a slave here. Just Uh, ask him. Well, if the illusion of him is right there, they may be hesitant to give a truthful answer. We well, we can have the uh, the person disguised as him simply move through town, gauge people's reaction, and the others can react to their reaction. Like, What's with that guy? You just gave a dirty look too. What do you say we all uh, go to a bar and uh, you make it look like Taldor walked in? We can do that. Let's go. Alright. Bars are a great place. Alright, so, uh, your. You guys board your. Uh, your loading rowboats. Um. Uh, no, your, your actual tone. I feel like you were, like, doing a low voice for a while, not just your normal. Yeah, no falsetto. Um. So you guys, you guys, uh, take your rowboats to shore. You're about five miles west of town as to um, avoid your ship landing being seen. Marin ties the boats. He's good at that. <laughs> Sounds good. Dice tower away. And then we, yeah. Uh, totally good. Oh, go. yeah. All right. 20, 20 something. 20, yeah, 20 something. Slippery ropes. 22. Isn't it a plus 7? Uh, it's a plus 9. Plus 9? 24? Yeah. 24. 24. Fine. All right. We, uh... Start making our way into Bakersville. Okay. Hmm. I'm fully decked out in armor. I'm not half armor in this bullshit ever again. So. Yeah, good call. <laughs> Screw this part town crap. I'm full right? armor. Got my gnarly, sweet, oh, spiky, oh evil God. looking. Yeah, you look amazing. Yeah. You guys uh, get near Bakersville. You come to um, what you know to be the Baker's River. Um, and see, it's definitely wide enough for a ship to pass. And there is a um, small dock on the side of the river with a ferry and um, a ferryman. Okay, so from what we were told, are we are we coming up from the side that Bakersville is on, or do no. we have to cross the river? Yeah, I would have to cross. You have to cross the river. Okay. All right. Well. Do I speak so Approach the ferryman. How wide is the river? Are we talking like 60 feet wide? Like, like Mississippi, wide? bro. Like, Mississippi. like Mississippi. Okay, that's... Like, 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 like miles. two miles across? Three, four oh, miles? miles? Half mile, oh, mile. Is it half mile? Okay. Uh, Jack it depends. It, it depends, but we'll, we'll say it's about uh, three quarters of a mile across. Okay. Nice. Okay. The big ass river. So, yeah. don't fall off the ferry or you'll drown in your full plate. Gotcha. Or swim like a champ because you don't wear armor. <laughs> Says the unarmored guy, yeah. Drone for Easy for you to say, Marin. Um, I approach the ferryman. Hi. Uh, there's five of us, right? Nobody else from the ship came with? Correct. Cool. I mean, unless you wanted somebody to. Nope. We brought an army. Five passengers. How much? Five silver? I... Give him a Five full silver, gold. one each. I just hand him a gold. Okay. Thank you. He hands you five silver. Are you paying for everybody? Yeah. Skipper gets a ride for free. No, I've been on silver. Alright, get aboard. Two way four. Like Sweet. I kneel at the what would be the nose or the front in the direction that we're traveling. You wow. kneel there? I kneel. Okay, he uh <clears throat> he rows you across. Um, get to the other side. Um, there's 
about 100 yards to any other buildings. Um, and you guys can walk offload. Oh, uh, as we're uh, crossing. Okay, as you're crossing? Yep. I'll look back over my shoulder. Uh, is it human? Yes. Harry. <laughs> Someday I'm going to make that happen. <laughs> but, uh, Very fair man. Human dude? Fair yes. Older guy? What news of the Major area? Late 30s. Uh, nothing, uh, nothing of interest to me. What, uh, what type of news are you looking for? Anything worth passing on to a small group passing through? Anyone we should watch out for? Yeah, from the, the way you guys are dressed, uh, I'd say you guys are probably the ones to watch out for. <laughs> <laughs> Can't argue with you there. Pretty pretty quiet town. And all is well here? Uh, all is well that uh, can be expected. In a small, small town like this? Good then. Where can we rest? Eat? Hey, the, uh... The Dare Inn is, uh... It's about halfway through town on the north side. There's a thatched roof and an awning out front. One of the only buildings in town with a kind of a front porch area. Got a mayor. The mayor? The river's river's too wide. Plus, there are larger ships that come uh, come up and down this river. Otherwise, we'd we'd probably have an ox pull the ferry across. <laughs> Not a horse. Mayor. <laughs> ah. Oh yeah, we got one of those. <laughs> Has he got a name? Uh, his name's Czar. Mayor Czar. Czar Billmore. Mm. I think I heard of him. I haven't. <laughs> Round of ten. Is Am it I? Oh, no. Yep. Hold on, no. I'm gonna throw another bag on her. Is Zar or Zar? Yeah. Not even with a 25. It's three. Is it anything historically significant? No, no. Oh, that's too bad. Too Small nice. fishing village. There are like 500 people in this town. and Not even his family? <sighs> Name ring a bell? Name I think it's important to differentiate between whether it's Zar or Tsar. <laughs> which is the Russian, He's not a Russian ruling ruler. emperor. <laughs> this is not Russia, so either way, I don't think it uh, applies. Is it? Well, it also depends you on the spelling. Spell. <laughs> the fairy ferryman cannot spell. All right. Not in general, but just this one. Okay. Hmm. All right. I have no further questions, Your Honor. <laughs> <laughs> what, uh, what brings you guys to town? Passing through. Mead. Wizards. Objection. <laughs> Wizards? Well, I mean, yeah. Well, they didn't bring us to town, per se. I mean, they could. Some of them, I guess. Yeah, eh. are better than you believe in such things. Right? I don't believe in Do you not believe in magic? And I hope you do. <laughs> Some things around, but I mean, I mean, wizards that can... They can Travel long distances. You know, move ships. You know a lot about wizards. Do you know any? You move a ship. Are you? <laughs> She's a wizard. Yeah. <laughs> Fireball. <laughs> <laughs> Reflex saves. Everyone. No. So Marn. Marn constitution boat. save. Not on a boat. What? <laughs> Just to be different. Fireball specifically designed to go against my strengths. Yes. yes. Except I'm a barbarian. So I actually have a really good con save. Cool. Marin survives. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, I've seen I've seen people, you know, move objects across tables, or start fires just by looking at them. Wow. But I mean, I mean, big, big, powerful red wizard stuff. I mean, that's 
That's folklore. Okay. Sure. Wish that were true. Yeah, right. I guess we're out of questions. Side. We get across the river. Then, starts, I guess. starts whistling. And... Do I know the song? Perhaps in tenor. Uh, Perform. Check. Whistle. Whistle he whistles poorly. God, you it. you think you recognize the song a couple times and then it changes a bit. Okay. And he, so, then you start to recognize it and you're like, that's not the first song I was listening to. So he whistles the same one I do. And then you're like, but I but I recognize this and then it changes again. Question is, do I just one up him? You have a small area of time to do that. I don't know. Probably so study him. Do you stare mm-hmm. at him? Yes. I've studied him. He's stronger, faster, and bigger than you. Oh, I oh God. drown myself in the river. Fuck um, <laughs> <about> this game. <laughs> You, I mean, what what specifics are you looking for? I forget what your general run of the mill questions were. Nothing in high, higher level. I, just, I, I know three things. I'll ask you later if I need to. Okay, sounds good. I do um, that with almost everyone I spend a minute with. Okay, so you'll ask, you'll you'll determine what those three things are based yep. on the situation that presents itself. Exactly. <laughs> uh, as you guys uh, going across the river, uh, you notice that there's a large large island. That the river splits around. Um, oh, you guys are further north than that. Um, are there any side quests that appear? So like, so like you're you're crossing the river up here. Okay. And there's that big old island so there. To the south of us is some kind of island. Do, do we see anything on the island other than vegetation? No. Okay. And then, uh, as you guys are approaching the other side of the shore, you see um, an empty ferry like launch launch across. What? They uh, like completely empty, like a fucking no, no, no. Like there's boat. There's there's a there's a man on it. Oh, oh, pushing his way across. Way less interesting. Okay. Uh, <laughs> they wave at each other as uh, as they cross. So does that island actually have vegetation? Like it was assumed there was vegetation. So there, I, there I is like uh, um, very few trees. Mostly, um, like grass and tall brush. There is How vegetation. large an island? Is it like five miles across large? Uh, like, like can you see... like two miles can across. Can you see the ocean from the other side? Or is it you can, large you can big? see, you can see kind of a little bit of the ocean from the other side. Okay. Um, so it's a very, very low, um, you suspect that, um... You know, in the summer, or if there's any large amount of precipitation along the river, that it probably floods over completely. Okay. Hmm. And you guys, you guys land on the other side. Cool. Yeah. Thanks for. Uh, thanks for choosing choosing my ferry. Roma just fucks the fuck. We right. have a uh, choice in your river travels, and uh, we appreciate you serving you. Does your Does your ferry have a name? If I wanted to come back again, is there someone I can ask for? Uh, wait, wait. Your other option is try to try to swim across. Really, we were the only only thing. Does <laughs> <laughs> that know that? Uh, Do you have a no. wooden, wooden ship with your insignia on it? No, no. Good idea. Oh, Think about it. Trademark your ship. All right, you, you land, and he uh, hangs out. He starts. Uh, Starts carving on a stick. Okay. See? Yeah. Do we see a small yeah. town nearby? Yeah, you see a town. small town a couple hundred yards off. I head to the small town. How small is the town? I feel like, like a, a small town. Jesus. It's huge. All right. It's a small town. We make our way into the small city, looking for the northern side where we can find the tavern. The Russian? The Russian. Darren. Darren. Wait, Darren? Darren. 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 Darren.
think it'd be amusing, and why not? Yeah, why not? Awesome. Um, pea, meat, 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 wheat, broth. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds All right, so uh, the town is uh, Fireball. very, very quiet. Um, there are a few people walking around, but definitely no, uh, no bustling marketplace or. Celebrations or large crowds of any kind. Look poor as fuck or what? It looks pretty poor. Um, Do we see like a main source of uh, uh, wealth? Is it like agriculture? Is there like a smithy? Is there like a mill? Fishing. Fishing maybe. Um. It seems seems fairly d- diverse. Uh, from what you can see, there's no there's no overabundance of fishing vessels, but um, there's not a complete lack of them either. There's um, <clears throat> up the river a ways. You notice the mill. Okay. It's um, almost likely a self-contained economy. Primarily, at least, yes. Okay. Mm. Um, the the road outside of town is not uh, barren, but not uh, greatly traveled. You notice some farm fields uh, as you were walking in. Um, Houses off in the distance on both sides of the river. But yeah, you based on based on your other travels, you don't think they import or export much. Okay. So you're saying we burn the fields. I'll die. Quite possible. Uh, mm-hmm. Likely. In the name of Talbot. Um, in the name of Talbot. First, to ask about that Talbot. <clears throat> we find Dare in. Well, does it really matter how they feel about him if we make them hate him? Yes. Would they be likely to believe it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because if they love if them they so much, if they see him do it, just say. True. <laughs> I don't know much. Okay, I know. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, that's that's we know, Trim. We know. See about a, a mile, a mile up. You can see what you think is the the dare in. Um, off the left. porch. There's there's a porch. It says it's no, as the uh, ferryman it. described. Mm. Thatchy. Thatch roofs. Poor. A little more noticeable than some of the other. Uh, um, like slat shingle roofs on some of the other houses. There are a few other thatched roofs, but no other uh, ones with the the porch like you described. Is it like a roofed porch? It's a roofed porch. Is there a screen? On the porch? There's no screen. Have we seen people as we approach this? Yeah, you've Darian? seen uh, humans. A dozen people. A um, few humans. A uh, couple half elves. Do they seem looking. to take a particular reaction to us? Uh, everybody definitely definitely notices you. Um, a few few of the women uh, kind of shy away, go back inside. Um, children like run down the alleyway. And what time of day is it? Can you tell me? No, it's actually it's afternoon because you did scry uh, at ten. You scryed at ten. Yep, scryed at ten and failed. God damn it. And then, I forget which of you that was. Him. Probably me. And then you guys Came landed short. about noon and walked for a while. So it's early evening. Okay. So around, around four. Unless you unless you decided to make, you know, quick pace. No, so it's afternoon. Just I before mean, dinner time. Yeah, yeah. Time, time, good time for us to get dinner and get some rooms for the night, maybe. Absolutely. Um, does, does it, is one story building, the Dare Inn? Uh, it's a two-story building. Okay. All right, sweet. Uh, Roman walks up in, pushes the uh, the door open. Ah, nice. So, and there are uh, several people sitting around uh, tables eating. Um, as you said, it's a good time for dinner. Um, looks like a uh, large number of uh, citizens of the town or guests at the inn are. Uh, Enjoying dinner at this time. Is anybody armored with weapons? No. 
like us. Yeah, you guys, you guys, uh, <laughs> I sent the DPR opportunity. <laughs> Damn. Alright. Yeah, guys definitely stand out. It already kind of like, gives you a very long look and goes back to back to eating, keeping, you know, keep they continue to glance at you as you're you're in there. Nobody seems overly uh, alarmed. Yet I started tuning the niche. <laughs> 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 Alright, so yeah, Roman swings the door open, surveys the scene momentarily, and then walks over to a table that can hold all five of us. Right. Um, like on top of it? No. Yes. That's a stupid uh, yeah, under- under- Young woman uh, walks over to the table, um, hair in a ponytail, dark brown. Um, she's about four foot six. Wow. Uh, Neighbor, and she seems. Is she a dwarf? No, no. She seems like she's, you know, seven. ten or twelve. Oh, hot. Seven. <laughs> seven. <laughs> seven. Uh, <laughs> it's like, hey, and uh, what can I get for you? Beer. Mead. Food. <laughs> I pop a berry in my mouth. Okay. Mead. Food. Too. <laughs> Mead. Mead. No problem. Uh, Dinner. dinner? Yes. Dinner for everyone? Whatever you're serving to. <laughs> I'm not good at this. For for five, you say? <sighs> yeah. Six. Six. Are, are you eating? Just a real meal. Six. All right. Like so. Don't no, ignore me. It's just beer. What? what? Four meals? meals? Five you meals. Food? Five, five you meals and, uh, and, me- and six five. beers. Six beers? Lots right. of beer. Skipper. Casks. Okay. She, uh. Casks his beer. What? Runs off. Casks of beer. No. Stops at a couple other tables, fills some water for people. Water goes in the back room. Oh, I need some kind of All right, how are we going to... F- Whoa. How are we going to talk to the locals about this guy? Uh, what was it in common? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure. Uh, I'm, I'm, gonna have have just, I'm, I'm very experienced. I'm going to have cowboy walk through the door. I think somebody should s- at least stay by, the, just sit back and watch. And if we start asking questions and somebody suddenly gets up to leave, I can do that. Kill him? We should <coughs> follow him. Or her. It. Maybe. Is there anybody close enough to our table that they could possibly be overhearing if they were trying to listen to our conversation? Yes. Everybody. Yeah, about a dozen people. Okay. Well, shit. I turn, well, we haven't said any names yet, so yeah. there's that. I, I turn to whoever among those dozen is closest to me. Sure. And I, like, Start breaking scooch my chair, like, closer to their table, mm-hmm. which I'm assuming would get their attention, because I'm, like, six foot eight I dragon in, action. in, in plate mail. Spiky plate mail. Yeah. Okay. I'm already in action. Um, what you have to <laughs> and move action yeah, yeah. to drink <clears throat> to run Pardon to me. run to the door and tap on where you just run yes away. we are new to the area uh, uh, yeah um <laughs> you know, yeah <laughs> didn't notice uh people of this area who would be uh notable is there people that uh if we were to try to speak to someone uh of the going on around town who would Kind of person that would be in charge of this town or the general area. Someone in riddles. What? What? Riddles? What? No, no. We uh, looks at you completely confused. <laughs> no idea what. What the fuck? You're trying. You're getting at. <laughs> Who's in charge? Uh, the mayor, a lord. Uh, yeah, the, the mayor. King. There's mayor. Yes. And the mayor's name. Czar. 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 It's Czar Billmore. Yeah. Czar. Czar, Czar Billmore. The Russian yeah. king. I know. I know. I know. I know. Uh, and is there anyone who the mayor reports to? Uh, a noble of the overlying area? Uh, I know. I'm not sure. It just doesn't come up. I mean, I... There's barons around, I've heard, but I've never seen one. It never... Uh, doesn't seem to be of concern. Hmm. Uh, this mayor, is he a good man? Mayor's out? Yes. Fantastic. Then, I after, feel after we have our meal, then uh, I will direct any further questions to him. I, I appreciate your help. 
Yeah, you can probably find uh, find him in his office along the north road. Upstairs. You'll see it. It's uh, the east side of the road, right before you get out of town. Phenomenal. Thank you again for your time. You're welcome. I switch my chair back to the table. Good, good job. No. Mayor Zara seems to be the man to speak to. We have any questions? He does. Uh, it seems that there is no horrible overlording people in the area who would be bring any harm to these good people. At least not that they're willing to tell strangers. The wise player would vote inside against it. Yeah. Well, I think so. Uh, I mean. Did you ask just if there's somebody in charge, right? I mean, there's other things we can ask, too. Such as? Who do they pay taxes to? Seems like a funny thing for an outsider to wonder. Well, aren't we funny people? It's, I think that that would be a question that we could direct to the mayor, rather than bothering these people. I still think you have to tell the walk in engaging people's reactions or an idea. <clears throat> we still do it that. It is a great idea. Yeah. If, I need to take a leak. If they don't know who we go outside, then I'm going to count ten on the open the door. You may tell the walk in. Instead of you? Yeah. Uh, I don't know how this works, but will you tell me? Go out and make Well, just I, go I with can him. come with you and I can make you look like him. I thought you were going to make him be him. Yeah, or I can go out there and, and make the air look like him. Or <laughs> I mean, I could go. Roman with looks at you like he's just I completely could go and I confused. Can, I can talk to him and see if he'll come down and be himself. <laughs> <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> I don't. I don't. Hey, Sheldon, you should come down. You make the air be him. Well, I mean. I can put his image on the Yeah, but you got to be outside to do that. Well, I mean, I'm going to have to, you know, attune to nature, use my magic to do that. Are you getting naked again? Well, I I don't have to. But there are some things that I have to do to make it happen. Uh, It just, you know, cause a scene. It'll cause a scene in here. So it would be easier if I did it somewhere where people can't observe me. No, so you just want to go outside by yourself. Then. So, so you want to get the whole bar drunk with you. Or all right, let's go outside. We're gonna go out there. I'll dip around the side there. I saw an alleyway. Uh, you make him up here. I'll walk in and conveniently leave the door open. We can do that. Unless you want to beat him, like I said. No, no I mean you're a little tall. Not gonna happen. Eldor. He's a puny little six elf. Foot. Aren't all taller than humans? Is, is he, he was six foot? Six foot. All right, maybe not puny. But puny, yeah. puny to me. I still say that. How tall are you? S- seven and a half feet tall. Yeah, I know that wouldn't work. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. So you guys are going to go out and yeah. come back in? Yeah. 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 Make out. Sweet. We're definitely not going Wait, now I can cast Firebolt into the end. Yeah, so we're going to go outside, and we're going to just kind of curl right around the bar to that alley right there. Okay. I Which side? Actively perceiving people. Which side? Act. Which side? Yeah. The, I don't know, the left? Okay. Left side. You walk out and go to the left? Yes. Okay. Uh-oh. Is there an alley there? Yes. <laughs> okay. yes <there's> <laughs> uh, so Bimble and I are in the alley. Bimble runs over. Bimble gets naked. Yep. God damn it! <laughs> I put my clothes back on. All right, I don't, I don't have to. I don't have to. Okay. So whenever you're ready, would be, just walk in, and he'll walk in after you. All right. So I wait like I don't know a minute, and then I go back inside, but I forget to close the door behind me. And then I cast Silent Image and so tell her walks in. Small. It closes. What? And Taldor walks in through the door. <laughs> <laughs> he closes itself? Properly hinged door closes itself. He's a it's weird. maybe a bumfuck little town without a properly hinged door. <laughs> okay, fine. The door stays open. Alright. So Taldor doesn't walk through a door. Cool. 
But he can. So what? Uh, what's Taldor wearing? Oh, he's supposed to wear clothes. <laughs> uh, <laughs> whatever, it, whatever. Did you ever see him last. naked? I've always seen him naked. It's part of being in tune with nature. You just constantly see yeah, everybody else naked. naked. Everybody. Uh, okay. Whatever he's wearing when you like, were scrying him, or like when okay, we fought him on the boat. Or when I saw him, him last. Or when I he. Uh, okay. Everybody. Everybody in the bar seems to give him looks uh, identical to what they gave you. Um, they look at him and they look over at you and uh, waitress c- starts coming out and bringing food and holds up a plate towards him and sets it down at an empty spot around you guys. Jeez. I'm gonna, I'm gonna insight the crowd and make sure those looks are genuine confusion. Yeah. Which is like yeah, they're genuine of... confusion. Okay. I, I walk I in. I walk in after they and seem to think I take a seat with us and Calder takes a seat at the table with us. Okay. okay. Sweet. So we begin having dinner and conversation. Tell her tell the person anything. <laughs> so tell her how are you today? He doesn't talk. Stop it. All right. You know, everybody keeps peering over and looking at the new people in town. And... All right. Yeah. Uh, that ruins my plan. Well, while while Kriv is is having a random conversation with Marn about something completely unrelated, okay, <laughs> uh, I whisper, you hopefully unheard night? because of the conversation, sure. uh, to Bimble. Um, How are we gonna make it go away? <laughs> That's easy. That's the easy part. Oh wait, no! <laughs> Don't do that. Stop concentrating. No, 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 no. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> Really? You just do that? Have him, have him yeah, like, you're smarter than that. <laughs> have him get up and just Am I? Are you wiser stage. than that? I don't know. <laughs> am I? I am. Oh, you are. Like, is there stairs? Yeah, yeah there's go stairs. Go up to the like, bedroom area with, out of sight. Around the corner. Ooh. Oh, good idea, Sakara. I'll get, I'll get us some rooms. And then you'll come up to the rooms. Oh. Shut up. I get up and I approach the bar. Okay. See the young girl that that served you. You got any rooms available? <laughs> How much for you? Uh, yeah. How yeah. many? Well, that should, should have three open. I'll take all three. Holy shit! It'd be three silver a room. All right. I give her a gold. You're really fat. Can, can you uh, take take care of the meal, or is one of the other gentlemen? Take How much? <laughs> uh, ten silver. I give, give another gold. gold. <laughs> Keep the chair. Holy shit. The meals are more expensive than the rooms. God damn. Oh, we had my I drop a couple it's, of coins. Really poor Need the keys. I, I oh, the rooms, rooms are open. Great. <laughs> All right. We get uh, three, four, and C. Yep. Three, Three, four, and C. <laughs> Perfect. All right. I walk back over to the table and I say, uh, "All right, I like your tell or your system. It's time for you to go to bed." Sorry. This is not. Not. I don't know if I need a hand or not. <laughs> I start walking upstairs to a room. I don't know what Bimble does. If anything, Talzer follows him. Okay. <laughs> Once he passes around the corner, disappears. Yeah, because he's out of line of sight. Right? Okay. I keep going up to the room and I go what, to room. What spell are you using? Silent image. I go up to the rooms and I just peer in each room to make. And I look under the beds to make sure there's no assassins waiting to kill us. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I can't see assassins. I try. Wait, look, okay. they're wizards? <laughs> Is there a wizard? Sweet. Still succeeds. Perception of 23 to find assassins. You still can't oh, see yeah. specify find wizards. wizards. I did not specify wizards. You you peer in each of the rooms. Uh, they all seem uh, vacant of assassins vacant and with assassins and wizards. There's uh, there's two berserkers. Small cot in each each room. Um, room C is is really small. It's just barely enough room for a cot. Uh, and, and a wash basin. Holy fuck. It's like, like a closet. closet. It's like a closet. <laughs> <laughs> they turn into a room. Yeah. All right, Bibble gets C. 
What? You're small. What? You're small. I think Skipper could see. I bet Vimblin's car could share that with Skipper. Possibly. I don't think so. Again. All right. Roman returns to the table to finish his dinner and his meat. Or I'll take C and just never go to bed. I would just fall asleep under a table, drunk. Again. We get room three, four, and C. C is a closet. It's tiny. You're tiny. I would be more than happy to take the uncomfortable room. Which one's that? I think it makes more sense for one of the small people to take it. What does that mean? You're small. Who? You. I'm actually quite tall. Thank you. Not compared to me. I'm taller than my brother. I believe you. Let's, uh... I wouldn't. He uses magic. I don't have a brother. Let's try to get an audience with the mayor tomorrow. <gasps> Audience. A gnome without a brother. Do we need to? Is it a sister? Get a hold of him tonight to set it up for tomorrow. Mm. I'd be more than happy to go to his office. Why don't we just all go to there now? It's Was, what? It's, right. I mean, it's not even time for dinner. What are we eating for? Should I'm we go hungry. get? Should we get Teller to come with us? No, he's staying. I finished my meal because I'm hungry. Because I don't have a stone flying around <laughs> my head. <laughs> Marin. I do. You want berry? No. Berries are good for I you. eat meat. I and eat alcohol. Thank you, Rika. Someone using a phone. Yes. No, that wasn't a recap alarm? No. No. Should be. What's a recap? No. And then after we're done eating, we go to the mayor's office, which is down the road on the east side of the road. It'll be like 6.30 and it's closed. Not closed. The neon sign out front is <laughs> dimmed. Uh, no. The, uh... Um... You see a sign hanging off that says mayor. Okay. In front of a building. Door is propped open with a stone, letting the you know, cool breeze blow inside. That's all they say. Approach the door. Kind of reach in. Heavy thud. Uh, come in. Um, as Roman stoops to enter the standard sized doorway, uh, he glances around his surroundings. Does this appear to be an affluent individual? Is he rich? No. Okay. He, uh... <clears throat> see a uh, larger uh, man, balding, sitting behind a desk. Um, some paperwork scattered in front of him. Looks up at you. Uh, uh, what, what can I do for you? Mayor Czar. Yes. And you are? I am Roman. Hi, ah, Roman. What brings you to my small town? News of the surrounding area and its occupants. Ah. Uh, I assume you mean uh, the castle to the north. Tell me about it. Uh, it stood there for several hundred years. Does everybody else follow in? Or? Yeah. I certainly do. Is there a bunch I outside? I hope so. Yeah. You mean you're among this wizard? <laughs> <laughs> oh, wizards. Is level there a bunch wizard? near the door? Called 20 Mirrors are wizard level 5 barbarian. God damn it. Oh, crap. This dude's awesome. Um, no one drinks beer. Hey, uh, oh. uh, I beg you to be more specific with your inquiry as to the, the nature of the surrounding area. In in light of seeing a large group of armored and armed people walking in, uh, he's a little less forthcoming with information than when I had thought Roman was alone. Um, well, shit. You guys fucked it all up. No, <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm Who has that. the most wealth? <laughs> uh, well, Craig is the, 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 the good guy. <laughs> he should talk. <laughs> I didn't follow you in. I'm sitting by the door. Uh, you're still in the inn getting drunk. Yes. No, you got to be with us. 
Uh, Am I? Yes. Yeah, because I brought the keg with. Oh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> We're merely traveling adventurers. So uh, we look to and, and help you those are? in need. Uh, my name is Kribnorxis. And uh, we merely look to help those in need. We enjoy <coughs> going to small towns like these and uh, doing what we can to aid them with their troubles. Um, I've, I'm not aware of how well news travels, but uh, certainly you may have heard of some of the troubles the local areas. Uh, we recently came from a midsummer festival, and uh, Mayor Varkin uh, was having some troubles in the area that he was incapable of or incapable of handling himself. Yeah, uh, which which midsummer festival? Which town? Uh, Sh- uh, Shintara. Ah, I've heard of that festival. Yes, it was a large, t- bustling. Uh, it's, it's people uh, travel from all around to it, from what I understand. It was delightful, but uh, unfortunately, some of the locals had recently come on hard times uh, due to the reoccurring festival. Um, the The town guard just simply could not help them. Uh, there were too many outsiders, as you said. People come from all over, and. Uh, in such the case, um, the locals, I don't want to say we're being neglected, but uh, the guard were doing the best they could. And we helped. And uh, as we are traveling adventurers, we hope to help your town as well. But, you know, it's, uh, <laughs> to, to help, we need to know more about the area. And, the locals. Uh, you mentioned a uh, castle to the north. Did I? Yes. Introduce yourself. I am Roman. No other commentary leads me to believe it's just Roman entering the room. Okay. Okay. He uh, he speaks of speaks of castles okay, sorry. and such. Uh, I, we are aware of a, a castle to the north. Thank you. And. Uh, castles and temples and caverns oh, are popular places for uh, dragons and beasts and humanoid ne'er-do-wells to take up. And if that is such the case here, um, then we would be interested in helping you. Well, uh, There's a castle to the north, uh, as you mentioned. Um, we, uh, they leave us alone, we leave them alone. Who's they? The people of the castle. Do you have any names? Tell me of them. Uh, well, uh, several years ago, uh, the castle had been uh, uninhabited. Um, some about about five years ago, some uh, ships uh, reportedly uh, started docking there. There are several lumber ships come up and down this river. Um, so seeing one in the in the river is not unusual. Uh, but we, I had heard reports of someone settling uh, that castle. For a small time, uh, there were um, small period. The first uh, within the first year that we we lost a few villagers. Uh, many believed to the inhabitants of that castle. Lost how? Lost. They uh, disappeared. People searched for them in the countryside, in the forest, and uh, found little sign. Are these children who would be prone to such activities, or adults it, who would know better? It, it, it varied. Uh, there were a few, few children, a few adults. Uh, but how recently has this happened? About four years ago. And no more since then? Correct. Are it there... is... Uh, It is my belief that 
whatever is going on there, uh, they decided to leave the immediate area around it alone. Or, uh, perhaps it was unrelated. There may have been a pack of wolves in the area. We do How not really know. Missing? Seven. Over the course of six months. But since it was proceeding, uh, or since, it, since it occurred briefly after this castle was inhabited, locals blamed them. Are there any that remain in the town of Bakersville? that have lost friends or family to this. Ah, uh, yes. All of the seven have relatives still, still here. And you say since the last went missing, the inhabitants of this place have left you alone. And you them. Ah, uh, yes. Occasionally there will be, uh, an outsider that comes from the north. Um, though we can never be certain if they're from the castle or travelers like you claim to be. Um, Have you any names of inhabitants? Any dealings with anyone? No, we haven't. I have not, uh, dealt with anybody that I know is from that that keep. Inside. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Ten. Worse. Alright. Well, <laughs> it's been over a minute. I want to know this guy's total class levels. Thirteen. His Damn. dexterity score. Just kidding. Is it, he, has, he has no class levels. Oh. Uh, his dexterity is so it's eight. A monster. He oh, learns less, current hit points. same, or greater. Sorry? Current hit points. Oh, less shit. than you. Yeah, it Thank was high, high, low, equal for each of those. You don't have to tell Thank me. <laughs> Zero, eight, and seven. Were ever recovered for any of the seven? No. Sounds like what happened in. What was that town? Shintara. Yeah. Shintara. Mm. It's unfortunately similar. Perhaps we can help here as well. Perhaps. We need to speak to the. Family? Families of the seven. Do we have time? I thought we were under time. I think they would rather not dredge up the past. I think they would be interested in saving their family members. Their and bringing up their memories, how do you think that will help them? By identifying them. So that when we enter the castle, and we slaughter those who try to defy us, we do not slaughter their family members. God! And if their family members try to defy you, you would not slaughter them? No. For they are not acting on their own will. Their will has been taken from them. Just as it happened in Shintara. Just as it happened in the Pirate Isles. And just as it has happened all along the coast of the Sea of Fallen Stars. We will put an end to this for you. Uh, as, I, as I said, it is, has ended, but if they were indeed at fault for this, which we have little evidence to point that they were, uh, I would rather you find results before we dredge up memories of lost ones. There are no results to be found without descriptions of their family members. Well, then give me what you have so I may not dredge up their memories. Well. Uh, there was, uh... Jeremiah. 
Yeah. Uh, he was lost at uh, 12 years old. He was a very strong farm boy. About five, five foot tall. Uh, always eager to, eager to give a helping hand. There was Esta. She was she was about 17 uh, came from the mill uh, let's see do you want you can just say he goes through the descriptions of the other five sure that works he goes through the descriptions of the other five that uh, if you run into somebody fitting such description, I will point it out to you. Awesome. Uh, everybody. I found one! God. Right here, it's Grim! <laughs> my nipple. <laughs> nice oh, my nipple. <laughs> the, uh... The old road that ran to the castle has long since overgrown. Um, you may still be able to follow it, uh, being that there are fewer trees along the way, just smaller shrubbery and whatnot. Uh, I know for sure you can go about a mile in, uh, hunted truffles up that way once or twice. Uh, but it's, uh... Castle's about, uh, ten miles North. Sounds all right. Do you need your rest? Roman says with a wry smile. I do. I mean, we wouldn't get there by what? Midnight? Mm-hmm. Attack at perfect time. that you may uh, inform your people. Please do not uh, bring up our town when you incite trouble in case you fail. <laughs> we fail. Our goal is to help towns, not implicate them as a source of trouble for those who would bring evil down upon citizens. Mm-hmm. Mine. Roman stands up, he takes two steps towards the door, stops, turns around and says, if there is anything else you can share with us that will aid us, we'll do so now. Is there a hidden path to the castle? Maybe a tunnel? Uh, None that I've heard of. The, uh, The castle borders the river. It uh, was set up to take shipments directly from from the river. Um, otherwise, there's also a entrance on the south end. Roman walks up. We appreciate your help, sir. Right. Take off. So we leave it off here. Clothing? Like Yep. Can you turn to nature? Here? Everyone, get the liquids. God. Get the liquids. Yes, Sakara. Can I have some of your liquid? Yeah, it really had to be. <laughs> yeah, let me fill that up for you. Thanks. Oh, God. Uh, do you want to do a recap? 
Yeah, go for it. Lose some time. Sure. Ready, Alaric? Here comes the battle. Recap time. 